what it is and what it ain't. I'm going to let y'all know what I think. But first, y'all need to hit that post notification bell button so you always be in the loop every time I drop a new video. Today, we're going to talk about the rapper Killer Mike. Now, rapper Killer Mike, he is an activist, you know what I mean, out there in Atlanta. And today, he had uh, something to say to the uh, city council because they got this ruling out there where it's going to be a new ruling saying that it's not going to be no nuisance allowed in the area where a lot of black businesses thrive. And so he trying to get that uh, bill thrown out so everything can keep running as good as it is. But a lot of people been saying in the news headlines that he's allegedly uh, working with the DA to get rappers uh, convicted on RICO charges and gang members and stuff like that because he all about bringing back the old Atlanta. He want to upbring the community, bring it back up to how he grew up. He want a lot more, uh, he want a lot more uh, programs in the school and stuff like that because he know how to get that program money. So he pushing for that, you know what I mean? And uh, he just trying to make sure the funds go the right way. But a lot of people saying, dog, you snitching. And you brought uh, 2 chains along with you to be an advocate. But uh, 2 chains just doing it for fun, you know what I mean? Because he just like the clubs. And he don't want, you know what I mean, the parties to close early. But they saying Killer Mike doing it because he doing this because he with the DA. You know what I mean? And he going to voice his opinion and he going to be heard because all the friendships and all the uh, favors he owed that, you know, this bill might not pass. You know what I mean? He's stepping up for the black community because, you know, he had a little barbershop and, you know, T.I. got his little uh, businesses. All the people that got businesses, they saying they might lose customers. So a lot of people saying, man, this just straight up. Uh, exposing Killer Mike as a snitch, you know what I mean? Because now he's trying to go after the city council, but he was just working with the city council. So I don't know, man. It just looked like, you know, Buddy just can't keep his nose out of anything else but politics and, you know, the community business. He's so into the community instead of being to what he need to be doing is working on his music and stuff, you know. But I understand that's what he get paid to do, to be a motivator, motivational speaker. But sometimes he speak too much on the wrong topics. But y'all let me know what y'all think about uh, Killer Mike trying to get the nuisance uh, law thrown out so people won't be getting arrested when they come to Atlanta and want to party after hours. Peace of mind.